Unit 5. Conversation 1. Haven't you heard yet? Vocabulary. How are things with her? Means, how is she? So so means, not great, but not terrible. Drop out of means, to quit school or a program. You're kidding. Is an expression of surprise or shock after hearing good or bad news. Have you heard about Unmi? No, I haven't talked to her in a while. How are things with her? Well, so so. She broke her arm. That's terrible. How did it happen? Well, she went skiing during winter vacation. She had a bad fall and broke her arm. That doesn't sound so good, but I'm glad it wasn't worse. How's she doing with her schoolwork? Haven't you heard yet? She's decided to drop out of college and become a musician. You're kidding. What made her decide to do that? Well, you know that CD she made in her home recording studio? She sent it to a record company, and they're giving her a contract. That's great news. Good for her. Maybe she'll be on TV soon. Give it a try. 1. Asking about other people. Practice. Listen to the example. Take turns asking and answering questions about the people below. Have you heard about Unmi? No, I haven't. How's she doing these days? So so. 2. Reacting to good and bad news. Practice. Listen to the example. Take turns asking and answering questions about the people from the practice above. Have you heard about Unmi? How's she doing these days? So so. She broke her arm. That's terrible. 3. Asking for more details. Practice 1. Listen to the example. Ask your partner about each of the people below. Be sure to ask for more details. Reverse roles. How's Unmi doing these days? So so. She broke her arm. That's terrible. How did it happen? Well, she went skiing during winter vacation. Listen to this. Part 1. Listen to three different conversations. What is the main topic of each conversation? 1. Have you heard what happened to Ellen's parents? No, what happened? The roof of their house was blown off by a tornado. That's awful. Are they okay? Where are they going to live? They're fine. They're staying with Ellen's brother right now. What's really bad is that the house wasn't covered by insurance. Oh, that's really bad news. Two. Have you heard about Steve? No, what happened to him? Well, he applied for a job as a script assistant at a big movie company. He had to take some sort of test. A test? What kind of test? Oh, I don't know. Some kind of grammar or spelling test, I suppose. Anyway, he failed the test, but they gave him a job as a movie extra instead. Isn't that great? Good for him. So he'll be in the movies now? Yeah, he's really ecstatic. Three. What's going on with Dan these days? I haven't seen him for a while. Well, he hasn't been too good recently. You know he lost his job, don't you? Oh, no. Why? What happened? His company went bankrupt. They didn't even pay him his last month's salary. That's too bad. What's he going to do now? He couldn't decide what to do at first, but I think he's going to move to California and look for a job out there. I hope it works out. As always, thanks a lot for watching. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. And before you go, give this video a thumbs up. 
subscribe and click that tiny bell and don't forget to check out some of our other videos on the channel. On to the next time.